Coach David talked about bouncing back mentally, you know, physically, you know, mentally. How important is that for the number one thing in America coming to your place? Uh, yeah, I mean, we just got to get back on our feet. Uh, we got to put the pass in the past, 24 hour rules pass. Uh, yeah. Moving on to Mississippi State, uh, looking at all their film today. Uh, I mean, I think it's huge. We just got to. We gotta focus on where our feet are now. It's kind of a good thing to kind of follow up on the monster game like the last year game. Another game that's equally important I mean I think it's like this every week. Uh, I don't think the number next to your name really means a lot. Um, every SEC SEC team is great. Um, so I feel like every game is big. I don't think it matters on their ranking. Uh, in the SEC every team is beatable every week with the, with the caliber of players we have. I think everything's huge. Who's the most pressure on Austin? You guys or them? I mean, I feel pressure every week. Uh, I mean, if you want to win and be where you want to be at the end of the season, there's pressure, so uh, you just got to play good. Do you think they're just as physical as LSU? You I, mean, I think they have. I think they've been the past five years. Uh, we've had a close game with them every year I've been here. Uh, I think they're a great team, uh, physical. Strong, smart, so thanks to me, good game. I know you've always been complimentary and believe you've been playing your game every time you talk to us, but do you think with the way everything went in the LSU game that there's even a more belief now in what you do and in what you comes to the table and how composed he was late in that game? Um, I mean, yeah. Uh, Lake's a great quarterback. Uh, I believe him ever since he stepped foot on campus. Um, he just proved to everybody what he can do. And I think it's going to go a long way for us. Austin, you've been around for a while. So how important is this being at home against a team like this? How much does the home field fans play to the best? I think it's huge. Uh, I mean, we can hear on offense. I couldn't hear anything Saturday. I couldn't hear any of the chats. I kind of had to look at the sidelines. So this game, we'll actually be able to hear the chats, uh, make the communication on who, who the mic is and all that. So. I think it's going to be great for the offense to be able to get back on the home turn. It was also good to see Daniel White make some big plays. I know he's, he's kind of tried to, to fill in. I, I know when you watch the game on Twitter, he's you know, saying something. You're saying he's kind of playing Kevin Dole with a little bit, being that dependable guy in certain spots. Is, is that is that a fair comparison in some ways to what he's been the last couple of weeks? Yeah, I mean, DeAndre's a great player, obviously. Um, the coach just tells you to play your role and do your job, and I think. His job was to do what he did Saturday. Um, pretty much won the game for us, but uh, just do what you got to do and be where your feet are, and everything will work out for you. And I feel like it's working out for him. Austin, I know it's a uh, it's a big game, but you've had some pretty big news here recently. I hear you uh, are recently engaged. Can you take us through that a bit? Yeah. Um, I mean, obviously it's love of my life, uh, so I figured why not go ahead and just pop the question. Uh, did it up at Children's Birmingham where uh, me and her have a foundation. Uh, kind of got all the kids involved with it, some of the ones that are pretty special to us, and uh, just decided to go ahead and do it. And you were you were pretty sure she was going to say yes, or were you nervous? Or? I mean, I was nervous, but I knew she was going to say yes. Uh, we had kind of been talking about it. Uh, we didn't really know what my future was going to hold, so we kind of wanted to get this out of the way and go ahead and get her going so we can see what happens. This is also a big week for her, is it not? Yeah, she's uh, competing in Miss Alabama, so she'll be doing that while well, I guess I'll be playing, and then right after that, I'll be watching her. What's more nerve-wracking, getting ready to start a game against LSU or asking Jenna to marry you? Wow, it's tough. I guess if I don't say her, then she'll be pretty mad, but uh, <laughs> probably LSU. <laughs> Anything else? Thanks, Austin.